Hey there, everyone. The Suck Out and Dog Game. Last time we fought a boss and then we went fast. And then in the cutscene, the game more or less just outright said that we're in the end game now. Things are gonna get harder on a video game level. So, I mean, curious to know what that means. This is the spooky level, slightly ahead of Halloween. This is a spooky rabbit. Hi, little puppy. Welcome to the forest. It seems kind of dark and spooky in here. Well, we're getting closer to Cruella's mansion. Uh -oh. It seems like she affects everything around her in a bad way. Any sign of Cruella's henchmen? I haven't seen anything, but now that you mention it, I can smell a trace of La Pelt's cologne. Oh, the palm feats. I'll keep an eye out for him. See you later, Crystal. It's, it's fried potato water. It's a pretty good smell. So the game just outright says that Krilla has a aura, of, like a cursed aura around her that disseminates evil wherever she goes, which is it's pretty cool. Not what you would expect out of the 101 Dalmatian franchise, but hey, man. I don't know. I never really paid attention. What are you doing over here, Crystal? I wanted to show you something. See this hole in the ground? It no. It leads to a set of underground passages that connects different parts of the forest. Oh, You no. can use it for shortcuts. That's great. Thanks. There's like some amount of detail on that rabbit. Like like the coloration on the tip of her, her ears, for example. Yeah, so after the cutscene, like, the camera kind of veered down here, but I don't know if I should be going here first. This is just sort of like a little house. Alright, there's bone on the roof, because that's where you put bones. Oh, uh, there's... Rabbit! You keep being around here. Hey, puppy, look at this! I'm pretty sure there's some good stuff locked up inside this shed. Okay. It's locked? Where's the key? I think the spider might have run off with it, so you might want to look around for some webs. He will probably be nearby. Thanks for the tip, Crystal. Those darn spiders always absconding with my keys. You're the greatest. Wow, that was straightforward. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, there you go. There's no, that's not a key. That's a soldier. I interpreted your glowy weapon as a glowy key. That's the kind of thing you do when you're a dog, maybe. I don't know, man. Alright, let's- here we go. It's log textures. Help me get on the roof. There's roof steak. Delicious and maybe good. Alright, there you go. Ah, uh, bark me. I did that. I barked. Alright, there's the bone right here. So... Can you go inside this house? Or is it just a big block with things? block with things. Well, you know what? I could use that roof stake, so, you know, best roof stake in all the city. Ooh, can you go in the chimney, though? Maybe if I stop falling. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Like, uh. Okay, no. The whole of that chimney is pretty solid. So look for a local spider to have a key to open that. I have not seen any spider webs or anything. Maybe that's what's down here, where there's a big log. Oh, that looks like a parrot. I thought I looked like a spider. A spider and parrots do share a lot of traits. Uh, I would go into them, but you know, I don't want to insult your intelligence and just kind of repeat things that is extremely common knowledge, like, like you know. That sky does not look like a sky. It really does just kind of look like uh, a background setup, like in theater. That's right, it's a mushroom. Bounce mushroom. Here we go, boat time. Yeah, melt in the water. It's, your bones are mine. Gross. Alright, I feel like I'm starting to be led astray from Terror House. See, the problem is my strategy here is I need to just stomp straight up and not, like, up and forward. What's that? Well, I think the pelt is nearby. And maybe you could use this log as part of a trap. Hmm. That just might work, Crystal. He's certainly too big to get through it. Good luck! Okay. Then the camera just gets on Frankie Muniz for a little bit. Well, I can, I can bark at it. Can I go in it? 
I'm too big to- no, I can go, it just kind of felt bad. Alright, fantastic. Uh, like, there's things in the trees, but I don't know how to get up there yet. If ever. Uh-oh. He's right there! Kinda. Okay. That was awkward. Whoa, check it out, I'm here. Hey, hey, hey. I have a tr- Cool, you have a tr- Uh-oh, here comes the pill. You have a truck? You have a trick? You have a trunk? Hello, you have a triple key? Right now. You have a traffic ticket? After you. you have a trampoline? You little monster! You talk to the puppy, and then the puppy barked, and then you're like insulted. Oh, no. Pretty rational people in this stuck. game. Someone get me out of here! I get it. It's because he's stuck inside a tree trunk. And then that happened. Oh. I think I smell a trap fur. What? A trap fur? Oh, you know what? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Alright? I am not. I'm going over here instead. Hey, there's another one of those setup that looks like I just want to topple it over. It's a helicopter. What am I going to see? Do that. You jump straight up and bark. Don't jump forward. That's the mistake I keep doing. All right, this is a treehouse part of the spooky forest. You gotta have one of those. Otherwise, is it truly spooky? Yeah, inquiring minds would like to within. Like to withheld. Oh boy, me and space are best friends forever. Now, to be fair, maybe, you know, I, sh I should just take the time to switch the camera around. That's the correct move to do. And one that I just never do. Oh, there's a lot of meat growing in this tree. Let's not question that too hard. Is this like a tree zone? I, I fell off! Yeah, so those bones. I mean, I'm here. I can't jump. It's just, yeah, you go there and there's just this little room. Oh, but here we can get to the meat, meat load. Yeah, all you can eat tree trunk meat. I don't know, man. It's just weird. Like, I, that is genuinely spooky. You, you're wandering around in the woods at night at dusk. There's fireflies around, a man is stuck in a tree trunk, and then you look up, and there's, you know, rough cuts of raw meat just kind of chilling there on lumber. That's right. Beep, 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 beep. Alright, there we go, here we go, here we go. So I'm halfway there bone-wise, but you're my second puppo. You left the bone behind. Whoa. There's a little guy. Soldier man. Barked at him and he blew up. That is not a safe feature to put on a toy. This is what I am saying right now. Right, there's more shenanigans here. Where's that helicopter? There we go. I know it died because its bone appeared. And it takes so long to die, but I appreciate... I don't know, there's something neat about the delay, all right? Free puppy here is just there. You're a super puppy! Super puppy. I mean, that's what they say. I don't know if I believe it yet. I do have telekinetic power. I can bark a soldier to death. I can roll around like that without any, like, prior momentum. It's pretty good, actually. I bring my own momentum. Bring your own! Then bark at a guy until he's gone. I think you can bark as projectiles, and there's one way you can keep yourself safe. So, you know, an incentivize to just be barking all the time. Which, hell yeah. Alright, so there's a bone over that springy mushroom. Keeping that in mind, but I gotta go up this crazy construct. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's right. Maybe I just wanted to get that bone now, huh? Did you consider that? Because it's not true. Ooh, 
Would I be more careful about the jumps if, you know, there was like a pit or something instead of very mild starting over-isms? Absolutely! <laughs> there's no denying it. Uh, alright, there's a soldier here. See, look at that, I barked at his missile and then his missile blew up. That's science. I think I saw the corporate logo that indicates the end of the level. Yeah. But, I mean, I feel like we're still missing a lot, though. Oh, jeez. I didn't even get you? I don't know if you're dead. Okay, you did die. Confusing. Alright, here's fresh meat. In the grass. Grass meat. Alright, yeah, I'm missing... stuff. So it's probably like a turn I didn't see or something. I, know, I do have a just take a path and go for it. I think it's better than just like double backing all the time. Man. Kind of being confused and tired and full of confettis. If you can avoid being full of confettis, I would suggest that personally. Also, I'd find that spider that's still a key. Spider web is the clue. Oh, dig spot right here. You know this place, the popular space. What is going on with it? Oh, inside this tree. Well, that's a tree warp the bunny was talking about, probably. Maybe? No, this is brand different. It's just, yeah. Where we go? Tree zone. There's a whole thing inside this tree, and this is, yeah, no, yeah. This is Barrow Net. It's just that there's stuff here to get. It's not just a friendly warp. There's things you need to get. Wild, okay. This is a system. Alright, Sniffer, where you want me to go at? I'm gonna let you decide. Which is basically letting me decide, because it's my own nose. Oh, dig spot here! Yeah, just look at this. This, this is where you dig. You can recognize this area. Oh, and here too. Yeah, see, it's right next to the shed that I'm, I need to unlock. Alright, we're, we're done here, I guess. I've never been here. Yeah, I have no clue where this is. Yip, 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 She's free. Keep getting trapped, though. Like, try better at not getting trapped. So there's just this big mound of dirt. A helicopter I saw just phase in. That's pretty good. All right, you got this rock here. Uh, yeah, so we got violence to indulge in. So we're gonna do some of that. There you go, Mark. Yeah, oh, you violenced me. Don't, please. There you go, there are your bones. Uh, for me to gnaw at. Uh, all right, so I think this is what I can spot here. Um, there's a path with the old helicopter crew. There's a tree. I wow, I just jumped right into you. And there's just like, there's a, more of a forest area with its own springboard. Oh, it's here. I didn't notice this. Okay, so first of all, yeah, I didn't go down that path, apparently. I didn't notice this mushroom. Because I remember noticing the sky bones, the branch bones. But I didn't notice this handy mushroom that made that gettable. Oh, dig spot here. Uh, Sniffer had kind of a problem pinpointing the exact location. Man, yeah, no, the Sniffer struggled to find that X. Wow. Wow, like, seriously? You made me, like, go up and down. You did not know. I think you want me to go over here? Yeah, I don't know if I've been here, down this pathway. I totally haven't. Alright, yeah, no, it- Oh, here's the spider hammock! Alright, yeah, it's just so- Nice job! Uh -huh. So it's just like these little areas that are just kinda like, you know, just off the beaten path. Kinda like awkward little, uh, moment- Oh, there's a key. Oh, so we don't actually encounter spider. I'm gonna get everything. Like, I'm going to be all pups, all bones, 
But now I can unlock a shed too. I can't wait to get a sticker. So I can find my way, hopefully, to the shack. That's the plan. It should be like on the other side of that, right? It's like, look at all these, like, yeah, like strange little offshoots. Blind corner. Yeah, this is the dirt mound. And you originally arrived from here. Like, absolute blind spot. From the log, here's the cabin. I got a key, it's in the bottom corner. I'm gonna use my psychic abilities. It's a head! All right, sure. Let's go on a fly around tour, why not? Yeah, why not? Show me the place, bird face! See, wow, you're flying way low to the ground, guy. Like, no, if I wanna ride from a bird, I wanna be flying high. This is the opposite. <laughs> I guess you don't want to show how this place looks like when, you know, we would be outside of the theatrical walls set up around the paths. Yeah, that would be a limitation, wouldn't it? I don't think it's supposed to look like a theater play, but, you know, like, we're outside. I did not buy into the illusion at all. I'm sorry. There we go. I like how the sniffer really does uh, streamlines the explorative aspect. Because, I mean, you could I mean, you could try and map everything out, and, you know, it would be doable. But this does make it a lot easier. For better or for worse. Oh, next time's gonna be a maze. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, maybe night might not be that bad. We don't know. See, it doesn't start looking like a maze. I don't trust that monkey. 